Greetings, YouTube. This is Yvette. Today is day number 10 of my 40-day fast, and it's actually the evening. So I'm about to go to bed, but I did want to let you know that I weighed myself. I am 146 today. I was feeling a bit fatigued because I didn't get good sleep last night because I was dealing with a backache. I had a car accident some months ago, and so it start, started kicking up. I have some muscle tightness, so today I did go to my doctor to get a referral for a different type of therapy because uh, physical therapy seems not to be clearing up my problem. But I had some juice um, this morning after my swim. I felt kind of woozy while I was swimming, you know, kind of uneasy on my tummy. And it's because I had another bowel movement, which this is really shocking me. I am continuing to take the bentonite clay, the psyllium husk, and uh, senna to kind of help those things move along so they don't just stop me up. But it's just amazing me that stuff is still coming out 10 days later when I have not had anything to eat other than the orange juice and um, my the water that I've been drinking and taking the trace minerals and uh, moringa in my tea along with the um, senna. So it's shocking. Um, it's so important not to just do a water fast because a water fast will flush out your, um, you know, have you sweat out toxins and have you urinate them, but it does nothing for your colon. And that's the part that's really important because we have all this stuff that sticks to the sides of our, the walls of our intestines and it stays in our system and it causes nothing but sickness and disease. That's how people get colon cancer. So it's really important that when you do a fast, that you are cleaning yourself out at the same time, detoxing. Um, so I'm not gonna ramble on because I know that I keep saying that about the water fast, but a lot of people are doing water fasts and they're doing them for 40 days and that's not great. And they talk about how good they feel afterward. They've done nothing for the gut. So there's things that are just sitting there, problems waiting to ha happen. And so I don't want that to go on with me. So I will see you tomorrow on day number 11 and let you know what how, how my weight's going and how I'm feeling, but I am feeling so great. And I can't wait till I do day number 40, just because I'm so excited that I'm holding on. All right, talk to you later. Bye-bye.